Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, my name's Savannah, if you're new here, I post lifestyle and nursing content. Um, I am a first semester nursing student and in today's video I'm going to do a nursing school essentials haul of all the things that I have bought to prepare me for nursing school. Um, I start in about a week, so I'm excited. Let's get into this video and show you what I got. Okay, so the first thing on the list is this stethoscope. So of course, this is a necessity. You need it in nursing. Um, you have to listen to the rhythms, the heart sounds, all of that. Um, so I went ahead and got a cheaper one for now for school, but then when I get farther on into nursing and like get a job and stuff, I'll get a different one. So I just got this pink Litman and um, super cute. So the next thing I got, um, well, I was actually gifted this from my stepbrother's girlfriend. Thank you so much, Maya. Um, she gave me this stethoscope case and it's like super bougie, super cute. Um, like if you can see the material, it's like quilted. Um, so in the top section of this is she also got me a like trauma shears and then two pin lights. And these are definitely needed because when you do your assessments in nursing school and in nursing practice, you have to look at the, you know, the eyes and use the pin light to make sure that the eye is following all that. So in here, I have that and then right here I'm probably gonna put some pins and pencils and highlighters and stuff. And then in the bottom compartment, it has this to where you can put the stethoscope in and close it. And then I'll probably put some more pins and pencils right there. So it's super cute, love it. Next, I was also gifted this by Maya as well, are these like Tribe RN um, little badge buddies like cheat sheets um you can take these to clinicals they tell like this one shows the heart rhythms all of that so these will be super helpful if i just don't remember something and want to you know re up my memory i can look at these so this will be great on clinical days and yeah really like these thank you again maya so next thing since we're kind of on the clinical side of what i've gotten um i got these little notepads um it comes with it was like a pack of 12 they're like little individual notepads that i can put in my scrub pockets and like jot down notes while i'm in clinical if a nurse you know reads out like a cl critical lab or like some value that i should know for everyday nursing i can write it down here and it'll be there for me um so those are going to come in handy and then i also have this folding clipboard um i found this at my job so didn't have to buy it, it was it was given to me and one of the nurses was like, take it. So it is kind of messed up, but on the back is also a cheat sheet. It shows like the pain score, uh, the P wave, PRS, all of that, um, normal ABG values, the pupil size, all of that. So it's another little cheat sheet. I can put like papers, if like my clinical instructors give me like an assessment form to fill out or something, I can keep that in there, put it in my scrub pocket. So yeah, that will be very come that will come in handy next thing i got that will be in used maybe for i don't think it'll be used for clinicals this will be used for like labs clinical labs in the school um it's this pink manual blood pressure cuff because you do have to learn how to do manual in school which i already know because of you know my background but it's just this pink one it wraps around the arm like so and then it has a little reed dial and then where you puff it up. Um, this one was super inexpensive. I didn't want to go too crazy again because in the actual nursing workforce, like they have manual cuffs there laying around and everything. So I got this planner. This has been in another haul of mine, um, but I did get this specifically for nursing school. So I wanted to retouch base on it. Um, I got this planner. It was like seven bucks at Target and 
it's very I like how it has like so it has like the monthly view and then it has like your daily schedule and like today's schedule and then to-do list so I'll fill that out for my classes my um, clinicals um, my class schedule homework that needs to be done for that day etc so I definitely 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 recommend a good planner for nursing school um, there's a lot going on a lot to learn a lot to retain a lot to do and so you definitely need to be prepared and organized as best as you can so you don't forget to do something so get you a good planner if you don't get anything else from this haul I <laughs> are these translucent sticky notes um, I really think I'm gonna like these you can like write on your textbook highlight things but not get it like messed up like I don't know about y'all but I rent my textbooks so this will be great for a textbook I don't want to write in because it's not mine to own um, and then I can also like draw the pictures and put it on my regular notes because I don't know about y'all but I am not creative I'm not artistic no ma'am so anything to help make my notes a little cuter would be great so I love whoever came up with these um, so a lot of times you'll have isolation patients and they want you to wear goggles and face shields and all of that, but sometimes those aren't like available or you don't know where to find them because it's not your hospital, you don't know the unit. Um, so I just bought these like cute little glasses. I'll show you them on. So they just look like regular readers, but then on the side they have like the goggle type rim. So they keep you safe you know and you'll be in full ppe so you don't get in trouble by clinical instructor or the fact like the staff i got this big water bottle it's the brand x i don't even know how to say that i'm not even going to attempt but this was also super inexpensive this was like 15 dollars, and it literally it's literally a hydroflask dupe and you cannot tell me that that baby pink is not the prettiest thing you've ever seen. I am literally obsessed. So it comes with this and three other lids. Like what the heck? Okay, so the first lid com that comes on it is with the straw, which we love her, love the straw look. But then um, the next lid is just a regular one, like a regular top. And then the third one is one of the, actually, I don't know what this is. Don't really know how to oh you pull down and then it's like that kind of lid is i have an ipad um so i decided to get this ipad case so it's the ipad case and then the keyboard um so i'm, I'm not sure yet how i want to take notes during lecture so i don't know if i want to bring my ipad and type on the little keyboard or bring both but either way i bought this as a tool to help me if i'm like wanting to just take my iPad instead of my whole computer somewhere, blah, 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 all of that. Um, and then to help me write notes on my iPad, if I decide to do that, I'm not sure yet. Um, I got the paper like screen protector to help make it feel more like you're writing on paper. It kind of makes your handwriting better and it just goes smoother. Next thing we're going to get into is the shoes. Um, you know, one thing about nursing the most important thing to me is the shoes like your shoes make or break your shift they do um if you do not have a good pair on you're going to be miserable your feet are going to be crying so make sure you invest in a good pair of shoes it was hard for me when i first started out in the medical field to splurge um because i was like oh my god 150 dollars for shoes but it is so worth it like if you don't get anything else get a good pair of shoes for real I know I said the same thing about the planner, but seriously, the shoes for clinicals, girlfriend, your feet will thank you. So, after all of that, um, the first pair of shoes I got aren't necessarily for clinical days. This is just to wear to class and stuff because most of my tennis shoes are super old and worn out and all that. So I just wanted to get, this is like a really inexpensive pair of Adidas that I found on um, Amazon and I'll have them linked in my storefront as well. So um, I just thought they were super cute, super simple. I actually wore them to my nursing orientation today and they're super comfortable, lightweight. Um, they were like 60 bucks, like I'm telling you, super affordable. So I just got these basically, I already got them dirty. 
I just got these mainly to just wear to, to class and all of that and not necessarily for like a heavy on my feet day. Um, but then I got these for my clinicals and everything else, uh, lab days, all of that. So I got another pair of Hoka's. I've had the Rincon 3's before, um, loved them. Um, so I wanted to try the um, Clifton 8's. So these are the Clifton 8's. I love this color. Literally everyone and their mama has this style and color but whatever it's like i got these off zappos which i definitely recommend they um sometimes they're on sale they ship i ordered these two days ago and they just got here shipping's really quick everything's really convenient i did the after pay option so i didn't have to pay 150 up front um and yeah i definitely recommend shipping super fast and these are so comfortable this thing that's also goes with your long hours at clinicals shoes feet not hurting get you a pair of compression socks i went eight months of working without wearing them and oh my god like they make the world of difference um so there's different types of compression socks so i have the long pair that go all the way up to the below the knee and then go to the feet love these i've worn these for months um and then i recently just purchased these calf ones um, I really like these as well. I just wanted to show y'all the scrubs that I got and kind of recommend some brands if y'all are kind of like, what brands do I get? What do I do? Um, I do, my number one is Med Couture, but I definitely don't recommend them for school just because like clinicals, you have to get a patch sewn on, like you're not going to be using them in the long run. Like I, the way I think is like Med Couture, like the type of scrubs you want to get when you're in a profession that you work at all the time. Um, and so nursing school is only like 15 months, my program. And I do need these colors after to be a nurse. Like these are the nursing colors in the hospitals that I work at. But why would I spend so much money on one that's just going to be embroidered and I can't even wear it to the like work. So I recommend I got cheaper brands because I don't really care what I look like at clinicals. I'm just there to learn, you know? And then once I graduate, you know, I'll get the cute med couture ones again. So the first brand I got is Mandala Scrubs. They're online, super, super cheap, you guys. Like $16.99 for the top, and then the bottoms are like $17.99 or something. So I just got them in medium, and they're the joggers. Super comfortable, definitely recommend like i said not the best quality you can definitely tell the price difference but they will do for my lectures and clinicals um and then the top is getting embroidered right now with the patch so i don't have the top with me but it's just a regular plain um top with two pockets on the bottom super cute um and then the next ones that i got are the cherokee brand these were like 25 dollars each which is super affordable um, so I just got this top um, and we had to get the patch sewn on and then I got in the top I got an extra small because they do run big so just be aware of that if you're ordering online Cherokee I would size down the last thing I wanted to show is my clinical bag um, it's this Vera Bradley backpack I've had it for a couple years but I've barely worn it it's like in brand new spanking condition and it has a spot for the laptop or like anything you need right here um then it has a big opening to put stuff there and then i can like put my stethoscope here and all of that in this pouch like that i was gonna spend money on a new clinical bag but i'm like what's the point like literally half the time your bag just gets thrown into a locker or under a desk and you don't even use it you know what i mean it just gets you from point a to point b so trying to be a little bit more real realistic in my purchases just because no need to spend a bunch of money when you can reuse some stuff and then i wanted to show you all the bag i'm using for lecture um it's just this north face bag i've literally had this since i was like a junior in high school and i'm a junior in college basically um so definitely good. It's in like perfect condition. It has two zippers compartments 
and as you can see right now it can hold like your laptop i have a, a clipboard um and some stuff like that and yeah that's what i will be using for lecture and some school supply type things that i got um i have this notebook by five star and it's like a reusable one so it has like pouches in it and then in the back it has paper so like each semester you can take the rings off and change it out and like reuse it for each class so it's kind of cost efficient um and then i have this notebook that just holds notebook paper so if like i want to just jot something down in class real quick and don't want to like open my spiral or something i can just store papers and stuff like that in here maybe like important stuff that i want to keep with me for reference or something um and then i just have this pencil pouch and in here i just have a ton of uh highlighters and pens and all of that um like I said, had these since high school, didn't see a need in buying a bunch more. Um, and then all, same thing with this pencil pouch. I just have a bunch of pencils. Um, I just got this medical dictionary. It was one of the like recommended things in my nursing program. And so I went, went ahead and got it. it. It'll be good for if I'm in clinical and they say a word and I'm like, what does that mean? I want to know what that means. You can just go look it up. It's just good reference, good to have throughout your entire career. And yeah, it was super affordable and it's just really little so it can fit in your bag and you can take it anywhere with you. All right, you guys, I think that is everything for today's nursing essentials haul. Um, if y'all have any items that I didn't mention that y'all recommend, let me know in the comments. Um, I hope these help some of y'all who are about to start or starting in a few years and just want to get an idea. I hope this helped. Um, since I start school in a week, stay tuned for more nursing school content in the future. I can't wait to make that content for you guys and I'm excited to document this journey. Um, but yeah, this is the first of many nursing vlogs. And I hope you enjoyed, and I will see y'all very soon. Bye, you guys.